it is here. You know all those videos with, with FNAF, and people are like, where's the FNAF movie? Where? Where's the new FNAF movie? Hmm? Where's the FNAF movie? Hmm? Now, not the fairy lovers, okay? We don't, we don't, we don't want them fairy lovers. We're talking about the true FNAF horror fans, okay? Because I can empathize, okay? When the first games came out, I loved it. And I was like, where is the FNAF? Finally. Finally. We have it, boys. We have it. During the Huluween um, Film Festival, actually, people started coming out with, obviously, you know, all these film fests. And um, all these videos, they're okay, but none of them struck me as much as the person that tried to basically make an indie version of a FNAF movie. And did they succeed? Well, it's up to you. The movies, or the clip, just the short movie, whatever you want to call it, um, it's called The Hug. And, well, you'll see why. But basically, it's an indie version of FNAF. And you guys can decide if it's good or not, but honestly, I love seeing ambitious filmmakers like this. Um, you can call it, in a sense, um, game, game jacking, though, because he is kind of just, like, stealing the premise of someone else's universe and kind of, like, just shoving his own ideas into it. But, I mean, that, that depends on what you guys just think about this stuff. Personally, I think it's amazing. But, I mean, you could also, like, you know, you, you could be offended by it at the same time. It's like it's like with other games when um, someone kind of copies it. So, when you see fan games of FNAF, some people get mad about that because you shouldn't be copying that stuff. Some people love it because, you know, it's it's more towards the towards the idea of the FNAF games. So, what do you guys think about it? I just want to show you this clip because, honestly, I think it's amazing. Um, you guys might be mad at me because I'm doing a reaction on it. But, you know what? I, I'm just going to get to the point. So here we go. Hulu presents. Hului. Let's get into this, guys. <laughs> the hug. And it's really good. It's really good. Now let's make the panda put on a show for us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hold on, guys. Pandora's on his dinner break. He'll be back in an hour. Oh, come on. Really, dude? Yeah, really. <laughs> what do you think this is? I'm sorry, is this loud enough for you guys? Okay. okay. Sorry, kid. It's dinner time. Even pandas gotta eat. It's a freaking <laughs> robot. It's my birthday, and I want a panda show. I want to pay in the show. Listen, <laughs> kid, pizza's here. Yay! Oof. Okay, no, follow the line. All right. It's just pizza. Calm down. Slick little kid, ain't I right? Let's be honest. We are, we all know something bad's gonna happen. We all we all know something bad's gonna happen. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Pandora the Panda. That's creepy. Hi, I'm Pandora the Panda. What's your name? Aiden. Oh, that's a pretty name. Do you want me to put on a show for you? Uh... <laughs> sure. <All laughs> sure. Right. But first, you gotta come give me a big fat hug. Get it? Cause, cause the title. Get it? Oh, cause, cause the title. Don't be shy. Realize how you didn't ha realize how he said I won't bite. Like realize how he said I didn't. Like he didn't say I won't bite. Question mark. Give me a... Hey! Hey! You're hurting me! I can't breathe! Help! Somebody! 
Oh dear god. Oh dear god. Oh! Ah! Ah! Oh my god! Alright, everybody calm down. We got it. There's one for you. Oh. Don't drop that. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Ah, look what you did. <laughs> there you go. There. Aiden! Have you seen Aiden? Where's Aiden? I love it. He's like, oh shit. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Come to the pizza script. Ah oh, no. Ah oh, ah oh, no. I love the song. Games and prizes for one and all. In Dory's Pan Pizza Palace. Come inside and have a ball. In Dory's Pan Pizza Palace. I love games and pizza. If you do too, I'd love to meet you. <laughs> okay, I'm done. I'm done. So, um, it depends what you guys think about that. Because, like, honestly, I thought that was an amazing film. Um, for what's put into it, it was good. Um,. Now, we're going to review it over now, obviously. So, a lot of other YouTubers have talked about this. Um, obviously, this is not a robot, actually. This is uh, someone in a, in a suit. And people are like, well, you know, it, it doesn't look human enough. So, like, I'll show you, okay? So, let, let's, let's play it. Do you want me to put on a show for you? But I think that's what makes it shine so much. I think that's what makes it so good. When you actually see this character, this, like, this person actually trying to act out these robotic movements. Because, let's say, let's say this robot did come to life. What do you want to be more? A robot that's moving, that's actually breathing, or something that's a robot that's just evil. I thought I thought it worked perfectly how it incorporated the sense of like is this moving on its own or is this just programmed this way? You know, like it was almost like illusion and that's that's what made this so good, you know. Um another thing I loved in this show was um I was cracked up. Where is it? I'm trying to find it. It's when, it's when the little girl looks back. Yeah, <laughs> and then she she looks back to see this. Wait, is it? Can I get to it? That that <laughs> she looks back to see that. Just like <laughs> this huge monster just about to bite out this kid's head, and she's like, <laughs> I love. It. She's like, oh hell no, oh hell no. <laughs> I love it. She's like. Timmy! <laughs> oh man, that's great. That's the funniest. That's the funniest thing ever. And then, and then to make it even funnier, because <laughs> this guy, he's like, oh god, he just he literally jumps on the table. <laughs> you look at all the kids, just look at him. He's like, oh my god, damn it. And then she, the mom, she doesn't even care. She, she, like she obviously saw this. The mom was seeing this, and she's like, well, there goes another one of them. Another less, a little one less mouth to feed, <laughs> and, then, and then you have this black kid over here, just like, oh hell no! <laughs> and then the thing I love the most, the thing that made this the funniest thing ever, was like, no, 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 and <laughs> they made it almost like an action scene. And I'm not sure if I can get like a better picture of it, but yeah, when you have the pizza cutter, the pizza, um, not the pizza, the pizza like slice thing, where like you can you know grab the the pizza scooper, the pizza s scooper, the yeah, <laughs> he goes in there with his, like, a weapon. Because, like, you know in all these other horror films, like, you know, they'll grab a knife. I think they intentionally did this just to make it, like, funny. Because, I mean, like, what are you going to do with this? What are you, like, what are you actually going to do with it? So, I thought that was cool. Because, like, let's be frank here. It's an animatronic. It's a pizzeria. You really think... They, they obviously knew this would be, a, like, in a sense, like, a comedy towards some people. And they, they did perfect with that. That's what I think. And the fact that they actually were ballsy enough to actually receive criticism for a, a short film like this. I think that's great. I think that's great. Um, I think they did an amazing job on it. And, I mean, I wish it would have came sooner, obviously. But, I mean, this I feel like this mimics the first FNAF perfectly. Um, and you, you don't need any special... special Fancy dancy Ladies, things in it, you know. Yeah. I think this did great. Um, I don't know what the budget was, but I mean, for what, however it went, it was good. Um, 
Now, obviously, if I want to be very picky, um, I thought the kid could have done a little bit better acting. Um, I don't know. Maybe the idea that this this monster, um, I honestly would have think I thought it would have been a lot lot creepier if um when the eyes went back it didn't just like come back like the same with like just red veins it would just like came back or not 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 came back at all you know um because then it would have felt more like an animatronic but like after this like it kind of makes us feel like it's a demon that's like in this suit that's like alive you know that's what it makes it out to be and obviously that's not what it's going for but um also one that changes his face maybe it's just me but i feel like it's just it, it's not it's not it's not a quality thing um i don't think it really does the the best but i mean you know that's me being picky overall this thing was amazing and i love it seeing ambitious filmmakers because even if you fail even if you fail at something at least you tried and that's that's what makes these films amazing because people that are waiting for something to try even if it's just to like critique them they're willing to be, take their critique for the sake of making something that everyone desires a reality and that's what this filmmaker did, and I feel like he succeeded greatly. So, um, honestly, I'm not a big fan of Hulu. I don't personally have it, but um, from hearing about the hype of this, and I probably didn't add too much to the table, but for how much fear, how much you could immerse yourself into this, and the fact that they added like a little bit of comedy to it, it made this perfect for fans, fans of the FNAF series. Like this is obviously what this was directed as, and. I just hope that this does succeed and we can see more things like this where people are ambitious enough to keep following things where people are like, hey, this would be a good idea, not being scared to be critiqued for it. Also, I got kind of annoyed by the the bear's voice. Hi, kids! My name's Ida I don't know. Maybe, like I said, I'm picky. <laughs> but either way, um, <clears throat> hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, go check out the thing yourself. Tell them, tell them down in the comments below what you guys thought about it. I'm sorry, my voice started to die. <laughs> But, um, I love you guys. Thanks so much for watching. My name is Blue out. Um, please, sub sizzle if you have not already. And maybe, maybe like, if you, if you didn't like my review, my, my, my anime review, maybe, maybe just give me a dislike. But yeah, other than that, I love you guys. Smile, keep your head up, and I'll see you guys next video. Bye, guys. Whoop!